Hey guys, so it's Elena. I'm gonna um, go over with you hermit crab care. You may not need this, you may not have hermit crabs, but if you do, or you're going to get some, I can definitely tell you how to take care of them. So, let's get started. So the first thing you need for a hermit crab is a tank. And the tank has to at least be 10 gallons. And this is a 10 gallon tank I have. I'm going to upgrade to a 20 gallon when I get more mulch. And not mulch, I mean sand or substrate. And enough money for one. So what you need in a hermit crab tank is a water bowl. It's not too small. It's not very deep. And you need a sponge for that also. And you need a lid. You absolutely do because they can climb up this. Like No matter what, they will find a way to climb up if they want out. You need a food bowl with food. You need at least four to six inches of substrate. This is four to six. This goes from there all the way down to here. Um, you need... Some climbing things. You need extra shells, of course. You're going to need extra shells. You need, and you're going to need a little hut for them to go in. And then you're going to need a light. Okay, so I'm just going to go ahead and take off this um, thing so I can just show you my hermit crabs. And yeah. So whenever you take this off, you want to make sure the light is also off so it doesn't like set the ground on fire. So, I know when I'm on hermit crabs, <clears throat> they, or he, or she, I don't know if it's a boy or a girl yet, because it's very shy, and it's only out at night whenever you can't see it. He's under there because he's molting. Then I have two, and I recently found out that I had a baby that I did not know of, know about. And then that is the daddy. So I'm just going to go ahead and take them out for you guys. The daddy is not shy at all. Just this, and then... It's a purple pincher. Yes. This is the baby. You want to pick them up with two fingers and just hold them so they don't fall out. I'll be showing you how to give them a bath in my next video. See, that is two, and then that's the daddy and the baby. I don't know if... That one's a boy or a girl, or the one I'm about to show you is a boy or a girl. But I will find out soon enough. And see, he's molting. Or she. And there it is. And I'm not going to take this one out because I don't want to disturb it from molting. But yes. There we go. There's one of mine. Just walking around. I'm going to give them a bath later. And you just need some substrate. Wait a minute, what is that? Okay, sorry. Um, just got my brother in to help me. That was just water. Kind of freaked me out, but... Oh well. So, just have that there. And I'm going to redo their tank, and I'll be doing a video for that. Because it's, like, all messed up and stuff. So I'll show you how to do a tank. And yeah. It's just my hermit crab over there. Running around, and I'm going to give them a bath. So, let's go with me. So, to give them a bath, you just want to have... A water bottle. A big, big um, thing. You don't want to fill it up too much. So that's why. Or you can have a tiny bucket like that. I'm just going to take this water bottle here. And I'm just going to pour it in there. So I just opened it up and I'm going to pour it in for you. So it's just poured out, and you just want to spread it a bit, so it's not too much, and they won't drown. Just go ahead and spread that out here. And 
not all in one spot. It's everywhere. So that is there, and my hand's kind of wet. So I'm just going to pat it down on my leg. That's just everything. Man, it's not spreading out. I think it's like absorbing into the wood or something. But, oh well. Now you want to get your hermit crabs and just go ahead and put them in. So I just put my least shy one in here because, yeah. And so, let's go ahead and get a close-up. Here he is. So that's how you give them a bath. They don't know they're having a bath, so they just walk around in the water. So just let them walk around for a bit, then you can change around to your next one for walking. So what you want to do is you want to have a separate box, so so they can just walk around without the water, but I'm just going to go ahead and put in all of them, and let you see what that looks like. So that isn't all of them, but I just, as I said, the other one I think is molting, so I don't want to take them out or anything. That's the baby. This one, the baby has pinched me, so I don't know if it's a boy or a girl, but it's pretty small. Um, and yeah. This one right here actually loves the water, because whenever I sprayed water inside its show, really liked it, so... Oh, and, um, this hermit crab actually has four dots on the back of its back, so I'm, I don't know if it's a boy or a girl, but I, it, I know it didn't have that baby, um, my other one did, but, I mean, it could've, I, I don't know. So yeah, that was today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed and learned how to bathe hermit crabs and everything like that. Um, comment, rate, subscribe. Thanks. Bye.